And at the number one spot, we have At Hey everyone, welcome to Fun with Stats. Today we are going to go over the top 10 richest women in the world. Make sure you watch until number one because we have someone new in the top position and the current pandemic may have helped her reach that position. So let's begin. At number 10, we have Gina Reinhardt. Her net worth is 13.1 billion. She's from Australia and her source of wealth is from mining. Reinhardt is Australia's richest person and she built her fortune on iron ore. The daughter of high-profile iron ore explorer Lan Hancock, Gina took her late father's bankrupt estate and rebuilt it into something much larger. She chaired the mining and agricultural company Hancock Prospecting Group since 1992. The biggest piece of her fortune comes from the Roy Hill Mining Project, which started shipment to Asia in 2015. The mining magnet is also Australia's third largest cattle producer, with her portfolio of properties across the country. Reinhardt's fortune declined by $2 billion in the past year as the pandemic pushed the value of iron ore down. At number 9, we have Sihong Weiwan. Her net worth is $14.6 billion. She is from China and her main source of wealth is the pharmaceutical industry. Sihong chairs the Chinese drug maker Hanso Pharmaceuticals, which produces oncology, anti-diabetic and other drugs. Sihong quit her job of teaching chemistry to teenagers and got into the drug business. Her company stock rose by 10% early January to March when the pandemic was most prevalent in her country. Sihong married Sun Pao Young, a billionaire chairman of Jiangsu Medicine. At number 8, we have Lorraine Powell Jobs. Her net worth is 16.4 billion. She's from the United States and her source of wealth is from Apple and Disney. The widow of late Apple co-founder Steve Jobs, Lorraine Jobs heads Emerson Collective, a hybrid philanthropic and investing limited liability company she founded in 2016. Lorraine Powell Jobs inherited billions of dollars of stocks in Apple and Disney from her late husband and Apple co-founder Steve Jobs. In 2017, she bought a minority stake in the parent of NBA's Washington Wizard and the NHL's Washington Capital. She also purchased stakes in several media outlets, including a majority of the Atlantic magazine and all of California Sunday and Pop-Up magazine. At number 7, we have Suzanne Clatton. Her net worth is 16.8 billion. She is from Germany and her source of wealth is from BMW and pharmaceuticals. Suzanne Clatton owns 19.2% of the automaker BMW. Her brother Stefan owns 23.7%. An economist with an MBA, Clatton helped transform her grandfather's Altana AG into a world-class pharmaceutical chemical corporation. Clatton is the sole owner and deputy chairman of Altana, which pulls in more than 2.5 billion in annual sales. She also holds stake in wind power outfit Nordex AG and carbon and graphite producer SGL Crew. An heir to car maker BMW, Clatton has seen her net worth tumble 20% in the past year as car sales slow down amid the pandemic. BMW stock fell by 24% in the first half of March. At number 6, we have Yang Yuyan. Her net worth is 20.3 billion. She's from China and her main source of wealth is real estate. Yang Yuan owns 57% of real estate developer Country Garden Holdings, a stake largely transferred to her by her father. Yang holds a degree from the Ohio State University. She is the richest woman in Asia. Her father started the real estate company Country Garden in 1997 and transferred 70% of Country Garden's shares to her in its IPO in 2007. Country Garden's initial offering raised $1.6 billion, or as much as Google raised in 2004 in the United States. Young chairs Bright Scholars Education Holding, a Chinese education company, and it went public on the New York Stock Exchange in 2007. At number 5, we have Jacqueline Mars. Her net worth is $24.7 billion. 
She is from the United States and her main source of wealth is from candy and pet food. Jacqueline Mars owns an estimated one third of Mars, the world's largest candy maker founded by her grandfather. Jacqueline and her brother John each inherited one third of the 35 billion candy company known as M&M and Milky Way bars. She worked for the company for nearly 20 years and served on the board until 2016. Her brother John owns an estimated third of Mars. Her late brother Forrest's four daughters own the rest of Mars, which also has a large pet food and vet care business. Her son Stephen Badger is the chairman of Mars Board of Directors. As a well-known philanthropist, she serves on six boards including at the Smithsonian's and the National Archives. At number 4, we have Mackenzie Bezos. Her net worth is 36 billion. She is from the United States and her source of wealth is Amazon.com. Mackenzie Bezos is an author and ex-wife of Amazon founder Jeff Bezos, to whom she was married for 25 years. They divorced in mid-2019. As part of the divorce settlement, Jeff transferred 25% of his Amazon stake to McKinsey, which was 4% of the company. In May 2019, shortly after she announced the terms of divorce on Twitter, she signed a given pledge promising to give away at least half of her fortune. McKinsey and Jeff met in 1992 when they both worked at hedge fund DE Shaw. In 2014, she founded Bystander Revolution, an anti-bullying organization. Mackenzie Bezos, who has published two novels, was a student of author Toni Morrison at Princeton and worked as a research assistant for her. At number three, we have Julia Koch. Her net worth is 38.2 billion. She is from the United States and her source of wealth is the Koch Industries. Julia Koch and her three children inherited 42% stake in Koch Industries from her husband David, who died in August 2019 at the age of 79. An Iowa native, Koch moved to New York City in the 1980s and worked as an assistant to fashion designer Adolfo. She worked with many high-profile clients including First Lady Nancy Reagan. Julia met David via a blind date in 1991. They ran into each other again six months later, began dating and got married in 1996. With her husband, she has donated $10 million to Mount Sinai Medical Center and $10 million to Stanford Children's Hospital to study food allergies. At number 2, we have Francois Betancourt Mayers. Her net worth is $48.9 billion. She is from France and her source of wealth is L'Oreal. Francois Betancourt Mears is the second richest woman in the world and the granddaughter of L'Oreal founder. Betancourt Mayer and her family owns 33% of L'Oreal stock, which recorded its best sales growth in more than a decade in 2019. She has served on the L'Oreal board since 1997 and is a chairwoman of the family holding company. She became France's reigning L'Oreal heiress in 2017 when her mother Lillian Bettencourt, the then world's richest woman, died at the age of 94. Together, L'Oreal and Bettencourt Mayer's family agreed to donate $226 million to repair the Notre Dame Cathedral following the 2019 fire. And at the number one spot, we have Alice Walton. Her net worth is $54.4 billion. She is from the United States and her source of wealth is the Walmart. She was ranked the ninth richest person in the world and the richest woman. American heiress to the fortune of Walmart Inc. She is the daughter of Walmart founder Sam Walton and Helen Walton and the sister of Robson Walton and Jim Walton and the late John T. Walton. In her early career, Walton was an equity analyst and a money manager for the first commerce corporation and headed the investment activities at Harvest Bank Group. She was a broker at the EF Hutton as well. She is more focused towards curating art rather than working for Walmart like her siblings Rob and Jim. In 2011, she opened the Crystal Bridges Museum for American art in her hometown Bentonville, Arkansas. Crystal Bridges features works from the likes of Andy Warhol, 
Norman Rockwell and Mark Rothko. And that is the top 10 richest women in the world. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe, turn on notifications so you don't miss out on more videos on the top 10s, top 20s and top 30s, fun with stats videos and much more. Check out this playlist on my top 10 videos. Also check out the video on this page of the richest people on earth. I'll see you in the next video. Take care.